Hello, my name is David Physick. I'm proud to be one of the judges for the Northern Power Women Awards. It's great to read those submissions and see the values-led innovation being driven out of the north of England and helping disrupt the usual skew towards London and the southeast. There's an old Native American saying, we do not inherit the earth from our ancestors, we borrow it from our children. I reflect back on the custodianship of my gender, my age demographic, I don't think we've been particularly good stewards. Last couple of weeks I've seen more reports issued about the composition of boards at big firms. We're seeing a change in gender and ethnicity, which is pleasing. But if those new bottoms on the old chairs around the board table continue to do the same thing, you know, that, as Einstein said, is the definition of insanity. Managers and leaders are different. Managers concentrate on doing things right. Leaders concentrate on doing the right thing. In that regard, as you look at the goods and services you produce and make decisions for the emerging future, are you taking into account what the late American folk singer Pete Seeger remarked? You know, if it can't be reduced, reused, repaired, rebuilt, refurbished, refinished, resold, recycled or composted, then it should be restricted redesigned or removed from production. Seeger's view is very much the external one. Internally, the focus must be on developing a healthy organisational climate and a value-driven culture. The two organisational health conditions are different and both, both need to score highly. That score is dependent upon how you behave as a leader. If you're autocratic, ambivalent or amicable, you know, you're not going to drive those health measures. You need to be more authentic, assertive. You need to exercise tough love, what I call blue four leadership. Those in the C-suite now need to start focusing on the triple bottom line Profit, people and planet. You know, if that doesn't happen, then the current situation will not change. George Orwell said, in an age of universal deceit, telling the truth is a revolutionary act. I'd like to think Northern Power Women will ferment that revolution. Have a great day today, and I hope to speak with you all again soon. Bye.